You all know they say Jamaicans don't know how to make mac and cheese. I just know they're lying. First, you want to make your roux. If you make your mac and cheese using roux, this is the part where I fucked up because I should have added my cheese in before my roux gets so thick. At this point, I was starting to believe that we really don't know how to make mac and cheese. This is literally trusting the process because it was really a trust the process stage at this point. If you haven't been to the gym in a while, then this is a whole workout in itself. You want to add some of your favorite spices. Don't go too crazy now. I added a little bit of condensed milk. Yes, I know you all heard me. I say condensed milk. Mind your business. It was still too thick, so I added some heavy cream. And baby, this thing is silky smooth like me. Oh my God. I put eggs in my mac and cheese. I know some of you all have mixed reviews about um, eggs in mac and cheese, but I really don't care. You all see that cheesy goodness? Oh my God. Then you want to pop this in the oven at 350 degrees for about 25, maybe 30 to 40 minutes. I don't know. Until golden brown. You all see that? Oh my God. You all look at that. Look at that. You all see that? You all see how cheesy, how creamy this is? Anyways, you all guys, click the link in my bio. Follow my, um, not follow, subscribe to my YouTube channel. And don't forget to click the notification bell. Bye.